Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. So today I am going to talk about how to read a newspaper for RBI grade B exam, RBI grade B and the NAVAD grade A exam, right? So till now I have recommended you the newspapers, till now I have recommended you, you can follow uh, either economic times, business standard or business line. So if you are buying a newspaper from the market or from the in the print uh, format, then any of the economic times or business standard or business line all of them are actually great but if you are using a mobile app the business line is actually amazing right the economic times is there are too many ads in the economic times and then it's too much about stock markets but if you are using your android or iphone then business line is amazing uh, you should install actually bank exams today's mobile application uh, we are analyzing and summarizing RBA's notifications all the international reports all the government schemes uh, but these the newspapers and the mobile applications are also very important so today I have noted down uh, the articles from the today's newspaper that according to me that's how you should pick the articles from a newspaper or a mobile app for the preparation of RBA grade B or NABAD grade A examinations. The first one, the MSP of crop will be fixed at one and a half times of cost, the Modi. Mr. Modi said the MSP of the crop will be fixed at one and a half time of the cost. So in this article, there is a brief description about how the crops are priced and there, there is a, actually they mentioned about uh, a government scheme right so that is actually important from examination point of view right so the second point pnb to claim in insolvency proceedings of nirav modi and the second article bankruptcy code on test so these two articles are actually very important nowadays the bankruptcy code the npas these uh, these topics are actually very important for the exam very very important in the rba grade b exam i expect there will be at least two questions for, uh, two two markers two marker questions from this topic from the npa topic so this bankruptcy code this is a hot news so you can expect one or two questions right so bankruptcy code on test and the pnb to claim in the insolvency proceedings these two articles I can connect to them and these are actually very important so these are the two important points then eway bill roll out from 1st of April so very important uh, eway bill is required for goods uh, if you want to transport the goods worth rupees 50,000 uh, or more uh, if you want to transport them for 10 kilometers or more then the eway bill is required uh, this is that there is a proper article on eway bill that article is actually very important as GST is in the news so still a lot of people are confused about it and RBA wants uh, their employees to be aware about the GST law so this is actually an important article that if, if I was actually reading the newspaper that is an important article I'm going to avoid all the crime news all the masala news I should I am I just avoided all the politics uh, crap and all but these are the important point then SBI to set up a blockchain based exchange for bad debts very important topic SBI to set up a blockchain based exchange for bad debts very important topic then Lakshmi Vilas Bank and Wisdom to team up for the digital NPS, digital national pension scheme. There is a lot of confusion about the NPS. So we get a tax deduction. Uh, if uh, on the ATC there is a limit of one lakh and fifty thousand, but NPS provides fifty thousand additional deduction, uh, additional deductions uh, besides the ATC. So this is an important, but there are a lot of confusions about the NPS. Nobody is actually selling it because this is a government scheme and the people and the brokers, they are not getting their cuts. So they are not pushing it. They are more interested in mutual funds, insurance and nobody is pushing the NPS. There are no sellers, there are no brokers. So that one is actually very important. Then next one, I have already done a, a proper lecture on this point yesterday on my course. What are tax benefits of gratuity? There is uh, recently there is a change in the gratuity act, the payment of gratuity act 1972 I think. Uh, the tax exemption has been increased from 10 lakh rupees to 20 lakh rupees. The government employees they don't need to pay any kind of gra uh, tax on the gratuity money they received. But uh, the public, uh, uh, the other private sector employees and P uh, the other organizations 
they need uh, the employees their employees need to pay the tax on the gratuity money so the lower of the actual gratuity received or 20 lakh rupees or the third one 15 days average salary for the tenure of their service tenure means 25 years or 26 years or 20 years and it should be more than five years to claim this benefit so that that was an important topic so these are the six seven topics actually six or seven topics that i find that i found actually that these topics are important from today's business line newspaper or today's business line mobile application i just gone through it i spent like 30 minutes for you so these are the important points if you are not following a mobile app if you are not following a uh, financial newspaper if you are not following the rba's bulletin if you are not following the bank exams it is mobile application then you are doing a mistake so don't do such mistakes so that's all for today students and yes we are doing a proper course for rb grade b exam if you are interested in this course you can call me at 906720100 the link to join the course is available in the description students uh, that's all for today please send me your feedback in the comment section uh, please click the subscribe button click the like button and comment below that's all for today students thank you and have a very nice day bye